Welcome. In this video, I want to go over how to use the navigation alert trading service so that when you receive a trade alert, you can quickly and easily execute that trade. So if you look on the screen, I'm showing my actual cell phone and uh, I just entered a trade and sent out an alert. And as you can see at the top, this is an opening trade. And if it was an adjusting trade or a closing trade, it would say so. But in this case, it's an opening trade. And I sold two contracts of an iron condor in TLT. And you can see it's the November 18th, 2016 expiration cycle. And then just below that are the strike prices. You've got the 137, 140, 128, 125. And I got filled at an 82 cent credit. So I got filled at 82 cents. Let's go to the platform and execute the trade. So here we are on the platform and we're on the trade tab. So we put in the symbol TLT and then we want to go to the November 18th, 2016 expiration cycle. So you want to open up that option chain and the first strike that we're looking for on the text alert was 137, right? 137 calls. So we want to right click there, sell iron condor, just like I've always taught in the class. And, and remember, the, the strikes that we're looking at to trade are the 137. And so you can, on an iron condor, you can really just go down the line in the same order that they came in on the text message and it makes it, makes it really efficient. So 137 and then 140 is the call that we're buying. And then the 128 is the put we're selling. And the 125 is the put that we're buying. So we enter that there and, and there you go. So as you can see, and this is a good example because now you can see it's trading at 81 cents. Okay, I got filled at 82 cents. Sometimes you're gonna get filled at better prices. Sometimes you may not get filled as, uh, as good of a price, but it doesn't really matter. Um, first of all, you wanna make sure that the trade fits into your overall portfolio. You don't have to take every trade that I take, uh, but this is a good example to, to show you of, of what you can do. And then, I, as I mentioned, I put on two contracts. And so if we right click, and analyze the trade, brings us over to the, I've already got one up here, so exit that. Brings it up onto our analyze tab. Make sure you set your slices to break even, just to get your slices where you want, and just to make sure that the trade is in, the, is in order and is exactly how you want it and execute it. So this looks good, this is exactly what I'm looking for. So I can go ahead and right click, Confirm and send, send, and I'm not getting filled right away. So just as we teach in the course, go back to your trade tab, you can right click, cancel, replace, move it down a penny, confirm and send, and see if we get filled there. We may have to give up another penny or two. That's just part of trading. Cancel, replace, Let's move it down to 79, confirm and send. And we got filled at 79 cents. So then you go back to your analyze tab and you can see right here our max profit on this is $158, max loss $442. Uh, again, this, just, this is just a sample trade that I put in my, one of my smaller accounts. Uh, you, you need to trade the number of contracts that fits your account size and fits your portfolio. I hope this was helpful and we'll see you next time.